Abu Bakr Tafar Balewa University Teaching Hospital in Belchi has recently made another remarkable breakthrough by carrying out a successful kidney stone laser surgery known as laser lithotripsy, a surgical operation which does not require cutting the patient's body but rather using the laser machine to reach the stone and break it down into pieces. Chief Medical Director of the hospital, Dr. Yusuf Jibrin, while briefing journalists shortly after the operation, says this breakthrough is as a result of the latest development recorded by the hospital in terms of acquisition of the state-of-the-art facility and expertise. Our Bauchi State correspondent, Awal Hassan, completes the story. This is the face kidney stone surgery using a high-powered laser machine going on in the Abu Bakr Tafa Baleo University Teaching Hospital in Bauchi State, North East Nigeria. took the combined efforts of a team of medical doctors and other health professionals, led by consultant urologist Dr. Everastris Azadu, to accomplish this Herculean task which lasted for hours. We just passed an instrument into the bladder, up the ureter, saw the stone, fragmented and dusted it with a laser, took out the parts that were big, and we have left a tube there which is going to be removed in about two weeks' time, and the patient can start doing his normal duties. By tomorrow, actually, the patient can go home. In those days, patients with this kind of illness were referred to other places outside Bauchi or even abroad, owing to lack of facilities to carry out this kind of operation. But today, the story is different. Now we are able to get the facility and the expertise. And uh, we are able to bring some experts from Abuja that performed the first operation together with the team of our doctors that are here and other supporting uh, doctors and uh, medical personnel that assisted them and doing this particular operation. That surgery ordinarily will involve making a big cut on the patient's side, okay? And then you get to the stone, take out the stone, sew it up, and then close up. The patient is going to have a big wound, probably being hostile for about 10 days, and then he's going to go home, still nursing his wound, and if you know anything about wound healing, it will take about under three months for him to be able to really be able to go about his normal duties. This kind of surgery, which is called laser lithotherapy, is achieved as a result of the acquisition of state-of-the-art facilities by the Abu Bakr Tafa Balewa University Teaching Hospital in Bauchi. This teaching hospital, Abu Bakr Tafa Balewa Teaching Hospital, Bauchi, um, we've acquired a state-of-the-art laser, uh, quanta homium laser 100. It's a, what we call a high-power laser, and it can do a lot of things. You can use it for general surgery. You can use it for gynecology. You can use it for urology. Today, we're using it for urology. That brought this procedure closer to us. Before, as I mentioned earlier, many people have to go even outside the country to India, Europe, Saudi Arabia to get this kind of services. But now it's nearer to us at a very affordable cost to the patient. Vice-Chancellor of the Abu Bakr Trafa Baleo University, who was there to witness the surgery, says as partners in progress in the area of research and development, the institution has been supporting the hospital in many ways and will continue to do so. Now the issue is that you know, we have facilities and uh, you know, university is uh, meant to be t for teaching, research and community development. And this uh, is Abu Bakr Trafa University Teaching Hospital. And if the teaching hospital you understand that they are, must we have to have different way of solving issues. And we know that uh, we're also in Bochi, and whether it's a teaching hospital or the university, we are working for the, uh, for, for the people of the Nigeria. So whatever we can do to assist, I think we can do that. With major milestones such as this, medical treatment outside Nigeria will be reduced. Awal Hassan, Viewer TV News, Bochi.